She's asking me, did I take care of your cubs? Let's find out if Daddy took care of your cubs. I'll take take care of your cubs. Did we take care of you today? Hey folks, how you doing? It's Ronnie. I wanted to talk about uh, the electric XP 2.0. We're going to talk about that. Uh, I'm taking the cats down there to a lake. Uh, I'll show you the cats real quick. That's uh, Wilfrey. Hey buddy, how you doing? And that's Fairlight. Fairlight. Hey. Okay. So, um, it's just right down here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and ride down there while I'm holding this camera. So, bear with me. I used to do that on my mountain bike, so it shouldn't be too hard to do. Let me turn it down to lower pedal assist. How you folks doing? Doing pretty good? How you doing, buddy? Doing good? Take him down there to go see the ducks. How you folks doing? Doing pretty good? It's a little cloudy out today, but uh, loving this uh, electric XP 2.0. 46 miles, that's what I'm on now, as you can see. 46 miles, and I'm hoping that's going to last for a long, long time. Yeah, it's a great bike. I was actually at the Aldi's the other day, and this lady comes walking up to me, and she's like, I got one of those bikes. Right, she's got one of those bikes, and uh, I said, how many miles you got on it? She said, oh, we got five miles. I said, well, you know, you got to ride your, your bike. She, she said, like, her husband's more into riding a bike. But she thought it was really cool to see someone, you know, ride the electric. I'll just kind of give her some tips. I said, you know, lock up your bike. I've used two locks to lock up your bike. <laughs> and obviously, you know, go, go in at, you know, specific times. And also avoiding going out there when it's really busy. So, all right, well, let me get to the lake. Uh, we're just right down here, and uh, I'll restart the I'll launch the video again, okay? So, a very happy electric user myself, and I want to talk about Prize Rebel a little bit later, too. I got a cash out coming out a little later. We'll talk about that soon. See you soon. Bye -bye. Hey, folks, I'm back. Um, I just got settled. I'll, I'll show you the bike. Oops. The cat thing uh, fell over. Sorry, kitty. <laughs> Here's the cats right here. Yeah, y'all having fun on your electric XP 2.0? It's like daddy out here torturing me on that electric XP 2.0. It was a big motor rod toy. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, I'll check out this lake, folks. Pretty nice lake. Very peaceful day. I made sure it's not going to rain today. It's just going to be cloudy today. So yeah, this is the kind of stuff you can enjoy when you're making money, working from home, and uh, speaking of Prize Rebel, I got a cash out uh, coming up. Uh, I think it's a little bit over ten dollars. And I did Swag Bucks. I got. Uh, I did a focus group. Twenty-seven dollars are going to pay me pretty soon. Pretty awesome stuff. And uh, fourteen dollars. Uh, I think it's it's about alcohol. So pretty pretty easy stuff, you know. Uh, definitely like working from home. See all the cool people. So there's a nice little trail over here. You can see. People over there jogging and stuff like that. I don't know if you can see over there. Yeah. But yeah, all right, let's talk about the electric XP 2.0, okay? Uh, got a little bit under 50 miles. Haven't had any problems with it. I got a couple of these accessories here. These are really nice. It's great for like holding Starbucks. I'm not really a Starbucks kind of guy, but I I get it for my disabled uh, girlfriend. She can't, she can't cook or feed herself, sadly. So this thing keeps dropping up, you poor kitty. Let's get you back up here. Sorry about that. Let's put you here. But yeah, she can't take care of herself. And uh, this electric uh, is going to help me out, get around town, saves money, you know, from riding cars and stuff like that. Honestly, I'm not, not really even interested in riding a car. You know, I'm all about saving money. Uh, speaking of that, actually, uh, thanks to Swabucks and... Prize Rebel and other service sites been able to get this electric XP 2.0. It's been really, really good. Uh, got it at the Black Friday deal. It came with the premium headlight right here. Premium headlight. And uh, it actually came with a, a bike lock and that giant seat and also the seat post. So my only concern I've had is trying to get this faint service. Either I'm going to have to learn how to do some 
minor repairs myself, which I'm sure it shouldn't be too bad. Or just take it to my local bike shop. He said he won't work on mechanical stuff. And uh, but he'll, he's willing to change tires if I'm not willing to do it. So, y'all having fun? Yeah, you having fun? I can't let you out. You might run off. Yeah, that's Fairlight. She's a sweet little kitty. That's Fairlight, and uh, kind of named after the mystical stars. And that's Wilfrey. Wilfrey. He's like the honorable Wilfrey, the middle-aged knight. He's like daddy named me. Wilfrey, I'm such an honorable knight. I love to eat all the time. Daddy loves feeding me. Yeah, <laughs> he's a big boy. That's his middle name, big boy. Here come the ducks. I remember one time when I came here, I threw a bunch of bread, and I felt like I was watching one of those movies, you know, all those uh, bees were just like flying toward your way, or bats. They were just like flocking over here. That's pretty funny. Here, you wanna go watch the ducks? There, there you go. Go check out the ducks. There you go. <laughs> she ran outside, and uh, this one lady said she wants to be an outdoor cat now, right? But uh, she came back. I don't want her going outside, though. These are my girlfriend's cats, and I help take care of her cats. But uh, when she ran out in the woods, I actually came came there and she heard daddy's voice and she's like oh, meow meow so she came back and eventually she came back in so that's kind of cute kind of adorable but yeah the days like this folks this is what it's about working from home and um enjoying night being grateful to all the people that are out there make the most of it stay productive work prides rubble works uh whatever it is you do work business opportunities i've done that in the past i'm not going to get into that um, did well with that in the past uh, but today's going to be more of a pleasant simple day and that's it folks I just want to just kind of show you the scenery what I'm doing today just kind of going out and about and uh, I want to take these cats out so I can get some fresh air hope you folks are doing pretty good want to say bye to everybody well free say bye <laughs> say bye sweetie say bye Fairlight okay you probably want to run. How did you carry the cats? Well, actually, I did show you earlier. Just put them on the handlebars, you know. And, and speaking of the handlebars and um, these, you know, the back rack, I mean, do you honestly need a back rack? I mean, you just put stuff on the handlebars. My mountain bike, I, I put like $100 in groceries on there. I mean, it may be okay to get a back rack, you know, for simplicity to put like, you know, milk and stuff like that, but I haven't had any problems just using the handlebars. So I just figured I'd just let folks know about that. All right. I'm sure you probably know that already anyways. Some people don't. Because like, you know, I go to a grocery store and people are like, Ronnie, like, how, how, do you go, like, how are you gonna carry all this groceries? You need a ride home? Like, no, I'm good. I like the exercise. And speaking of that, I was kind of worried with the electric XP 2.0, you know, if I'm gonna get lazy riding that thing. <laughs> no, no. I found that uh, putting on pedal assist one like on flat ground, that seems to work pretty good. That way you can kind of stay engaged with the workout. You feel like you're getting a workout. You put it on pedal assist two, it gets a little easy on flat ground. Maybe if you're kind of going slant, it can help you a little bit. But now I'm finding that just work, you know, going up hills, I'm actually getting the workouts. Um, you know, that normally you have to get off the bike and walk up, you know, walk up those hills, right? So. It's different with the e-bike. But very happy customer. And um, that's it, folks. I will see you in my next video cast. Under 50 miles, I'll definitely report in uh, about how I'm liking the electric uh, XP 2.0 experience. And I'm, I'm sure later down the road, there's going to be some woes. We all get those, right? <laughs> but happy times. Happy times. Stay productive, folks. Give Jesus Christ the glory in all things. And um, enjoy life. I'll see you in my next video cast. Bye-bye. She's asking me, did I take care of your cubs? Let's find out if Daddy took care of your cubs. I'll take take care of your cubs. Did we take care of you today? Yeah, I'm just a lazy boy. My name is Wilfrey. I'm such a happy little cub. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you like the electric 2.0 experience, don't you? Does that meet your approval? 
of taking care of one of your cubs? Yeah. If you ever cub is sleeping underneath the bed somewhere, right? Yes. You like it, don't you? You're just super happy. It's a my cat. It's a cat. He loves me. Do you approve of the electric XP 2.0 experience? Absolutely! I <laughs> certainly do! Alright, I'm so happy to have your approval too. Alright. He's like, I'm getting out of here now before Daddy takes me out for another ride, right? Alright. Hope you folks are good. Alright. Say bye to everybody. Nah. That's Deborah, by the way. Alright. And uh, I actually, I'm over here. I got to recharge this bad boy. So, yeah, I'm recharging it real quick. All right, I will see you in future videos, folks. Hope you're doing pretty good. And now he's hiding somewhere. <laughs> I'll see you in future videos. Bye bye.